失われたデザイアジムを探すためハイペリオン一行は転送装置開演の目を使い漁師の海へと入ろうとしたしかし作戦結果前夜アインシュタインが何者かに襲われ行方不明となってしまうデザイアジムを取り戻すためブローニャは転送門が閉じる直前単身で漁師の海へと飛び込む彼女と共に戦っていたテレサたちは混乱の収まらない開演場に残され That's right. So we're picking up right there. Oh shit, okay. The deep, outside the sea of Quanta. Lily, watch Rosa 6. Stay frosty. I'm not detecting any more unknown hostiles, but the Honkai is still attacking. Teresa, Branya jumped into the sea of Quanta. Why, why'd she do that? Why did she do that? The whole clothes, she can't come back anymore. Calm down, Rosa. Branya does not act on impulse. There must be a good reason. The eye is already closed. We need to control the battlefield and then try to contact her. Teresa's right, Rosa. I'm worried about Branya, but we need to get rid of the enemies first. You're right. You're right. We shall fight. We can't let Matushka baby us all the time. Come on, Lily. Let's protect Matushka and Teresa together. I can defend myself. The kids have calmed down. They should be able to handle the Honkai beasts. Please be safe, Branya. All right, let's go. The deep upper zone. Space time curvature has been reset. Honkai level is now zero. The eye has closed. What? Branya? Kakoli's heart sank as Branya's comm signals were cut. She jumped into the sea. What a brave girl. Gray Serpent, why did you open the eye on your own? Opening the eye was part of the deal. I simply chose the right timing. You dragged Branya into this. She wasn't part of the deal. It was you who brought her in, Kokolia. Your clumsy security didn't keep Einstein out. She should be the one going inside. Our deal is over if anything happens to Branya. That's not how you do business. Man, shut the fuck up. Unfortunately, she lacks Sele's immense resistance. The sea isn't exactly an enjoyable place. I can only pray that your sovereign would save her life. Do you think I'm joking, Worm? Swoosh. Kakolia drew her pistol and held it against the back of Grey Serpent's head. And what are you doing this time? I'll say this one more time. I want Branya returned without harm. Kakolia. 
Cacolia. Cacolia, we both know who we are. We stop at nothing to get what we want. That's why I was so impressed by your improvisation. You provoked the rebel in Branya and maneuvered her to enter the sea instead of Einstein. You convinced me that you're the one we're looking for. Oh no. Please don't tell me I'm mistaken. Matushka lied to Branya. Branya used to trust Matushka most. Kokolia, you fucked this all up. You're wrong, snake. We're different! Guess who's going to hell now? Oh shit! Not a chance they shot Kakoli, I'm telling you right now. Grey Serpent. At the other side of the eye, Teresa and the Alinavias, Alinavias, continue to fight the Honkai where Kakolia confronted the Grey Serpent over Branya's leap into the eye. Negotiations broke down. Kakolia pointed her gun at the Grey Serpent. There was a gunshot. Kakolia fell to the ground. She looked back in surprise, only to find another Grey Serpent. Sheesh. At least one Teresa battlesuit. Okay. Ooh, listen to this music. What the fuck? It stopped. Another gray serpent appeared, a perfect mirror image of the other. The two gaze at the fallen Kokoli in perfect synchrony as though they shared the two gaze at the fallen Kokoli in perfect synchrony as though they shared the same mind. You disappoint me. You allowed foolish animal instinct to get the better of you. We're different? Did you even hear yourself? A gunshot? What's happened? It's Matushka? Grey Serpent, why is he here? Miss Teresa, gratitude for your hospitality aboard the Hyperion. I hope you still remember me. Our deal is not yet done. There's two of them? These guys are twins too? Run! Matushka, are you alright? We're here to save you. Kokolia, do you know why we left you alive? Because I want you to pay for your choice. It will be worse than death, I guarantee that. The world serpent does not tolerate betrayal. The two gray serpents moved in sync. Oh shit, listen to this music! Let's go. Took out injectors from their pockets. They then pressed the injector needles against their own necks. What are they up to? They pulled the trigger and emptied the liquid contents into their bodies. Their bodies inflated rapidly like a balloon. The metallic cyborg instantly turned into a giant covered in magenta and scion colored carapace. No one would have known that they were two cyborgs known as the Grey Serpent. How did the Grey Serpents turn into Honkai Beasts? Hey, Honkai Beasts and Twins? They're ripping off the Vodka Girls. Rosa Idioka, this isn't time for your nonsense. I guess it's time to check out what the Jackal made us for. And how it does in the field. 
Jackal made for us. Let's fuck him up! That's impossible. How do they return their human thoughts after the transformation? And it's moving with human intelligence and agility. I've never seen anything like this before. The relentless chains force the giant beast into a gradual retreat. Something feels wrong. Despite human intelligence, they're just two Emperor class beasts. Up against a legendary S rank Valkyrie with strong support. He must have something up his sleeve. I gotta get the kids out of here. Oh, fuck. Rosa, Lily, leave them to me. You girls are to bring Kokolia to safety. No, I'm staying to help. This guy ambushed Matushka and hurt her bad. Teresa's right. Run, Rosa. I don't really like hurting my own kind. Oh, shit. I'm definitely not your kind. I'm definitely not your kind. Try a better pickup line, you worm. Remember that process that saved both you and your sister from death? I used the same tech to turn into this. What? Testing on you and other subjects helped us optimize the formula for creating a human Honkai Chimera. And your foolish Matushka thought she got the better end of the deal. I won't let you talk about Matushka this way. Calm down, Rosa. He's trying to anger you. Before Teresa could finish her words, the twin Honkai leaped into the air. With unbelievable speed, the twin Honkai fused in midair and stretched out its arm to grab the girl. Rosa! Lilia pushed Rosalia aside with her entire might but found herself captured by the fused beast. Let go of me! Oh, fuck! I caught the wrong one. No matter, it will make no difference. Time for a snack! Oh, shit! Rosa? Are we gonna save her? Hello? It fucking ate her! Wait, what? The presence of two gray serpents was surprising. Both of them had injected strange agents into their bodies and transformed into Honkai beasts. The horror did not stop there. The gray serpent's monster form caught Lily and devoured her, changing its appearance almost at once. Oh, it did eat her. Now we have a cutscene to watch. Discretion is better than valor. Secrecy is also a useful skill. So this is where he shoots Einstein. All right. This planet is out of safe places. Where am I? A dizzy Einstein struggled to get back on her feet. Looks like I'm still in the deep. My attacker didn't kill me. Perhaps I'm still of some use. You're finally up. The voice came from outside the door. Wary, Einstein took a look and found someone outside the room. Is it gonna be Rin? Her eyes adjusted to the dim light and gave her a clearer look at the stranger's face. What she saw rendered her speechless. What? It's Schrodinger? I wish you could see that precious look on your face. She's half... Schrodinger? Why are you here? Didn't you... Bad case of emergency... 
もう一つの次元に消えてしまったとそう言いたいなのです Bad case of energy imbalance, loss of physical form, and vanished into the unknown? Indeed. I fucking hate when people say indeed. I hate it. Indeed, that accident destabilized my physical existence and transformed me into a quantum entity. For decades, I was kept on the other side of the door. We've been looking for you, but you left no trace. I've seen familiar faces on the other side, but now I'm sure they're not the people I used to know. Ooh. In layman's terms, I fell to the bottom of the sea of Quanta. It's a blank, empty world. I managed to get out but lost my beacon to return to this world. And then you activated that device. That device being the Eye of the Deep? I have no idea what you did. You were the only one I knew amongst these people. Ambient energy level is now off the charts. Even in my bubble universe, I knew something was wrong. All of this energy came from a single point that I can't approach. It's the gem of desire. Someone touched it. What exactly happened in the sea? Tell me what you know. Let's talk along the way. The indicator light turned green and the door opened. Our conversation will take a while. Lily? Lily? It's time to fight. Do you regret this, Rosalia? You delivered her into my hands. Give Lily back to me. I like the voice acting. Oh, shit. Give in to the beast within you. You will taste even better than Lilia. Let's fucking get it! I've trained for this. My comment section yelled at me about using Sakura's quick draw. Rosa, calm down. He's trying to make you angry on purpose. But Lily, she... Lily isn't talking to me anymore. Rosalia gazed at the giant beast with despair. It only unleashed a feral growl. Mm, I like this sound. Click, clack, something cracking and slowly falling into the abyss. You maniac! A vortex of chains tore through the air, forcing the enemy to back off. Your strikes are weak, Teresa. I guess you didn't want to harm Blue. Of course, you're a school principal, and she's just an innocent young girl. The Grey Serpent spoke in a cruel, sadistic tone that pierced the truth of the matter. The girls dared not attack for fear of injuring Lilia within the beast. Every passing moment pushed Lilia into greater danger. Teresa suffered from the same. The activated Honkai genes whittled away at her consciousness. Desires for blood and destruction clouded their minds. Senses became heightened. Minor cuts caused extreme pain. But it also enabled her to detect something that she wouldn't normally notice. It didn't come from her arms, but the chains twined around them. The chains of Judah sent irregular vibrations to her body. What is this? Bam! A titan landed right in front of Rosalie and deployed its shield. Kakolia's weak voice could be heard over the comm links. She was gravely wounded and could hardly keep herself standing. This mech won't last. Take Rosa to safety. I'll try to buy some time. No, wait! 
We had our differences, but please, I'm begging you, please save her, Noka Kolia. I'm not just saving her, just... I'm not just saving just her. I'm saving both of them. Bam! The blue Asuka smashed one of the Titans into pieces. But Dark Train sprung out from the debris and fastened themselves around the beast. Rosa, calm down and listen to me. What is it? You have a keener sense of smell. You must have smelt her. Lily is still around. It's very faint, but she's calling out to help. She's calling out to us for help. Only Lily has this scent. That monster is emitting Lily's scent. I got it. I know where she is. Ray Serpent swallowed Lily, but could not incorporate her quickly enough. We must cut the monster open and free her. Time to chop this freak into a million pieces. Calm down. We only have one shot before Lily is lost forever. We're doing this together. I will immobilize him. You'll locate where Lily is. When he stops moving, you'll deliver a precision cut to open its carapace and matrix. What? I can't do it! You have to do this, Rosa. You're the only one who's connected to Lily's heart and soul. Aren't you and Lily the best partners? Have faith in yourself because Lily trusts you. But... Alright. Let's get her back, Teresa. Let's go. Dark Chains dance around Teresa, whose eyes shone like the setting sun. Warning. Active element level critical. The cold voice whispered in her ears, reminding her of a potentially fatal choice to make. But she made up her mind. Oh shit, this music is epic. I love this music. The stage is set. Time to shine, Rosa. This is the performance of your life. Level 4 restrictions lifted. Oh! oh shit oh i thought we were getting a cutscene. let's go all right so they sense that she's still alive teresa and rosalie has sensed that lily was still alive inside the monster the monster may have swallowed lily but failed to incorporate her perhaps it was due to lily's in incomplete surgical augmentations this was the girl's last chance to save the younger Alineva. Einstein once warned Teresa that unlocking Blood Knight Phase 3 was risky, but reaching Phase 5 may, has may have disastrous consequences, but they both knew what choice Teresa would make. At this very moment, Blood Knight gave way to the Twilight Paladin. Let's fucking go. Crimson Blood gave way to Dark Twilight like a bleeding sun fleeing before the Ebon Knight. Ooh, epic. Okay. Blood Knight Moonlight finally assumed its true form. What is this? You've never seen this before, have you? Looks like you need an intel update, bitch. Let's go. Take this. Let's go. Do this! Woo! That was stylish! Oh man, I love Yai, man. I hope that she uses a similar skill whenever you get her in uh, Genshin. I hope she can do like the shing. That's dope. Teresa clenched her chains to rein the monster in. I got a creating opening for Rosa. Almost there. The pitch black chains leapt, twisted, and danced back and forth. The solium links groaned and screeched on the verge of breaking. The monster was finally bound. It worked. It's been stopped. Rosa, now! Cutscene, let's go. The fuck? No one. No one has my back. I'm feel. Wait, what? I'm not sure if I can do Rosa, come on. My tail couldn't stop shaking. Rosa. I'm doing this no matter what. Bronya would never hesitate if it's Sele. And I'm definitely not losing to her. Lily and I are meant to be together forever. Epic music. Rosalia opened her eyes with determination. It was her time. Rosa, now. Rosalia began to run. She leapt over the chains and debris and dashed right towards the trapped beast. Lilia's voice flowed like a stream into her heart. Sleeping Beauty, help me now. Let's go.
Uh, she could have said something cooler. Lily, come back. I'll fucking save you. She lifted the great sword to strike the monster with all her might. This isn't the end of me. The monster suddenly broke free from the chains and swung its giant right arm at the girl. No! Rosa! Ting! His attack missed. The fist glanced across her blade and missed her by a hair's breadth before being viciously deflected. I knew you would ambush me. Rosalia had seen how Lilia reacted. Wait. Rosalia had seen how Lilia retaliated against her enemies in numerous battles. And now Lilia's signature move would carry Rosalia through. I'll turn you into stardust. Let's go. Fervent tempo. You did it. She better be alive. I did it. Lily, Lily's fine. Good job, Rosa. Now get away from there. You lost, Grey Serpent. No more tricks. I underestimated you, Teresa. But this isn't over yet. After spitting out his last words, Grey Serpent's broken body exploded and turned to ash. Did he just self-destruct? Who the hell is he? It appears that problems have been solved in my absence. Einstein? You're back. Madam Teresa, sorry for making you worried. You got some explaining to do, Kakolia. Yeah, be glad we're in the same boat. <laughs> Mutually beneficial. I beg you, Professor. Einstein's taking command of Kakolia's forces. Okay. That's what I like to see. I trust Einstein. Returned peace. Teresa and Rosalia rescued Lily after a titanic struggle. Schrodinger also saved Einstein and the two professors arrived on the scene. The Battle of the Eye of the Deep finally ended, but the war was far from over. I don't know what's going to happen in this chapter, to be honest.